Uh, my background is quite extensive in the industry. Of, uh, it spans something like uh, more years than I care to remember, really. 45 years. I started as an apprentice in the industry, progressed from a trade background through technician, technical, professional, and academic as a result of uh, an extensive course of studies. Building construction hand quite, put it another way, just two, three, maybe even four other textbooks that come out for 20, 25 pound each. So in terms of value, it's exceptional. It's designed to cover a huge number of courses. It's what I call a one fits all. Anyone pursuing an undergraduate program in anything related to construction, construction technology, has a background reference to cover all three years of their studies. Anyone pursuing an international certificate diploma, HNC, HND, similar qualities. It, it covers all the basic requirements for construction, technology, building technology modules, and units of study. Individual lecturers will format their own study programs. Um, but every student needs a basic resource to reinforce that study program. So lecturers will call upon a number of resources, not least the Building Construction Handbook, and students will find that an essential resource. And what level they're studying, there is information in the book and assist them to pursue their research. Services Handbook is a companion volume to the best-selling building construction handbook. Now both technologies are applied to construction and the built environment. Uh, services is the in an engineering input into construction of buildings. No student studying construction should go without some knowledge of building services. It's an essential. Construction technology and building services technology are parallel. There is only one advice. Go for it. It's the most interesting industry in the world, in my opinion. It isn't an industry you can define. It's all encompassing. If you want to be up to your ears in mud, you can. If you want to work in an air conditioned office, you can. It's an industry that encompasses every possible profession. If you want to design, it's there in architecture. If you want to be an engineer, it's there in building services and civil engineering. If you just want to stack one brick on top of another, it's there. Every every aspect every aspect of construction has something for someone, and it is so diverse.